All right, it's time for some mail. Zero eleven here. And today, James sent some mail once again. Now, this is a different mail. It's a James exclusive mail apart from one thing. I will be getting to other mail very soon, like next video or the video after. And also, uh, one of my prior mails, I could not find a note. I know that Sean sent it. Um, he sent a package with um, quite a few interesting cards, these being the highlights. And well, I found the note. It was like behind the address, like what the heck? I couldn't figure out where it was. But yeah, it's right here, <laughs> so. Let's read Sean's note before opening up James' big box. All right, let's read the note from Sean. I can't believe it took me this long to find, but hi again, Ziri. Sean here, again, more repack cards for you to shred through. Not as many cards this time, yet I figured I'd send a couple more during these rough times. Blank, I'm not saying that word. Before the Y2K events of the future, knock on wood. Hopefully there are some keepers I sent. Feel free to open whatever pack you want. First shuffle of them up if you'd like. Just save the box inside the box for last. We'll keep having fun and don't worry, I won't be a stalker constantly sending cards. Are you trying to say, what are you trying to say there? Too costly and you have gotten some pretty fancy cards from your supporters. Mix the cards I send look like OPT. I mean, not all OPT is bad, but it is interesting seeing some of the unique hits though. Take it easy from Sean. So thank you, Sean, for that. Can't believe it took me that long to find a note. So there's that. Let's get on to the James package. All right, here's a note from James. Oh my gosh, why is it ripped? <laughs> hey, Ziri, you ripped the note again. I didn't, what? Uh, okay. You should really be more careful. Here is my latest mail for you to open. I went with the Tops theme. Okay, Tops. They've been out of the hockey game for a long time, so it's gonna be some older stuff. Not everything is Tops, but most of it is. I miss Tops making hockey cards. I have always thought their products are better than any other company. I'm getting a little tired of Upper Deck as I find their stuff getting boring. I am also ticked off that Elias has no autos in SPA or ICE this year. That is pretty hostile there. I'm gonna have to get some 1819, aren't I? Anyway, this package isn't as crazy as the last one I sent. Hopefully it won't be as disappointing as that tin of Premiere was. Keep up the great content, James. Okay, James, see what James sent. So looks like there is a box of cards and then there's a couple of boxes in the box. So yeah, let's check it out. All right, here is the box, very heavy. Tops theme, huh? Uh, let's take out this card here first. Whoa, okay, that's uh, Tops Finest, gold card. 95, 96, I think. Wow, I think that's Uncle Todd's rookie year, but. Look at this card, geez, it's so heavy. Top's finest. Wow, that's really cool. If I can find anything on this, I will. I'll just throw in a little thing on there, but I'm not sure what this is. Is it actual gold? Probably not, but there you go. That's cool. Matt Sundin, before the captaincy there. Okay, I'm not sure what order to open these in. So we got some one touches there, so let's go on the right side here. Okay, starting off, ooh, we got a mask card. Um, is that Byron Defoe? Who's that? Um... Yeah, Byron Defoe mask card. That's from in the game there. These mask cards are awesome. There's Byron Defoe. There you go, that's cool. Ah, oh, this is nice. Michael DiPietro, CHL Auto. And yeah, I'm ordering some boxes soon. I'm probably gonna get some 1920 CHL. Uh, Michael DiPietro should be a carryover rookie for 2021. We'll see what Series 1's gonna look like if it's still coming out in November, I mean. I wouldn't go crazy on that stuff. There's a good chance that Lafreniere won't even be in there, but there, Michael DiPietro, Memorial Cup champion with those Windsor Spitfires there. So that's awesome. Really cool. Canucks. There you go. Got an Arthur Herbe. Different gear. Oh my gosh. Wow. Arthur Herbe. Dynamo Riga there. OPG. Huh. That's very interesting there. Uh, got some 88 OPG. Tom Barrasso. There you go. What the heck is he wearing there? He's got like a glove on there, huh? Like a small glove. Huh. Got a Wayne Gretzky. That's nice. Always nice to get a Gretzky there. Uh, what the heck is this? <laughs> it's like a credit card or something. Leaf Studio. What the heck is this? Has his stats there. Blaine Locker. That's an actual signature, maybe? Uh, I kind of doubt it, but very interesting card. It's like a credit card card. Okay, interesting. Uh, there's a Dan Cloutier, Pacific, Save on Foods. Is that like a promo card from, that must be a promo card from like 2004. Overweighty Foods? Definitely gotta be something out west there. Out in BC there, That's, James is from out west, so. There you go, Dan Cloutier. Oh, look at that, Uncle Todd. There's an Uncle Todd one, that's nice. 
Oh, we got another mask card. Kirk McLean. There you go. I recently pulled a nice Kirk McLean auto. But there you go, Kirk McLean. This is from the vault. That vault set that had these one of ones. Bunch of them. But that's really nice there, Kirk McLean. I don't think I'll ever open the in the game vault, but that's cool. Masked Men 5. Oh, we got some old SBX there. Uncle Todd. Oh my gosh, look at that. Kind of looks like the bobblehead there. His picture on the left there. That's funny. Uh, there you go. Uncle Todd Fisherman. That's uh, 95, 96. No, 96, 97, I think. I'm not sure the exact year on that, but there you go. Uncle Todd. Ooh, Sign of the Times. Is that what 506? Dan Cluche. Sign of the Times. That's nice, Dan Cluche. There you go, 506 SPA. You already know I'm tempted. I'm so tempted. Open some old 506 SP. I am so tempted. Um, but we got some more Gretzky tops. And another Gretzky tops. Is there something behind it? What the heck is this card? There you go. Awesome stuff there. And yes, I got a bunch of other mail to go through, so I will be doing that shortly. Hey, Michael DiPietro again. This is uh, from Canada Juniors. Um... It's like a blue parallel. Is that numbered? I don't see any numbering there. Yeah, I don't see any numbering. That's kind of weird, but there you go, Michael DiPietro. I got a Kirk McLean from uh, Premier. OPG Premier, right? Tops Premier, so Kirk McLean. Nice and card, like a refractor there. Got a Gretzky OPG Premier. I got a sealed box of 9192 Premier. I have to the side. I don't know if I'm going to open it as its own video, but I have it. Um, got a Tops Gold Label. Vinny Le Cavalier, that's like second year Le Cavalier, right there. So that's pretty cool, 99, 2000 tops, gold label. Uh, Eddie, tops, own the game, wins. There you go, that's uh, 0203. Uh, there's Jay Shiger, there you go. What number was he for wins there? He was fifth, Belfort's third there. Marty Broder, of course, so many 40 win seasons. Uh, you got Patrick Watt, ooh. Division's Finest. That's a really nice card there. So look at that. That's fancy there. Acetate card. Really nice. There you go. Clear Chrome. Pat Pending. 95 tops. Huh. Oh, look at this. Trevor Kidd. Tops Chrome. I, that's something. I know my brother opened Tops Chrome. But yeah. There you go, Trevor Kidd. There you go, Tops Chrome. That's nice. Oh, got some OPG. Oh, this is Tops Archives. Um, O2. Andy Moog. There you go. Tops Archives, that's, that's from 81, 82 it's supposed to be, but it's a reprint there. It's Tops Archives. Hey, there's Tim Martin. You already know I'm thinking about that promo set. Think about it six months ahead. But yeah, there you go, Tim Martin. That's cool. There you go, that's... These are really cool. I should get a box of this. So there's that. Another one, Jacques Plant. There you go, first goalie to wear a mask. Jacques Plant. That's another uh, 60s card there. There's Grant Fuhr, Archives. That's 80s for Fuhr there. That's early 80s there. 82, 83, I think he came in. Or at least his rookie was 82, 83, but he came in 81, 82. And Dennis Hall, Chicago Stadium seat. Okay, we got a seat piece. Huh, I know there's like weird like board pieces from way back when as well, but there you go. How many goals did the older brother Bobby score as a Blackhawk rookie? So that's Bobby's brother, Dennis Hall. There you go. Interesting. All right. Oh, we got another one. This one's actually a jersey card. Grant Fuhr. On the Sabres. And it shows an older card of uh, Fuhr there. I didn't even realize that. Same with Dennis Hall there. Those are actually really cool cards there. Grant Fuhr. 87 Buffalo Sabres. I don't know why it says 87 Sabres. He was an oiler in 87. He was on the Sabres in the 90s. Spent part of three seasons with them. Wow. Huh. Oh, look at this. Topps Archive. Certified autograph. Grant Fuhr. Beautiful. Now that's awesome right there. I gotta get a box of Topps Archives, don't I? There you go, little thingy there. Authentic. Awesome. Very cool. Uh, Canadian Idols. I remember these cards. Canadian Idols. Uncle Todd. There you go. Uncle Todd. Awesome stuff. Canadian Idols. Heater. Look at that. There you go. Look at that. There's my Idols right there. Uncle Todd. Heater. Awesome cards there. Uh, we got Vincent Rindeau. Stadium Club. I want to open some more Stadium Club. That's some older stuff. I wouldn't mind, like, uh, more recent Stadium Club, at least. Like, I've opened 99-2000-01. I wouldn't mind, like, 0102 or 0203. Um, Stéphane Fissé, Stadium Club. Quebec Nordiques there. Kirk McLean, Stadium Club. And uh, Eddie Belfort. That's early 90s Stadium Club there. There you go. Huh. All right, continuing on here. Package from James. More Stadium Club. Kirk McLean. 
Okay. And it looks like these ones are members only. Ooh, members only. I'm not sure what that means. Huh. Okay. Another members only. John Blue. Got a Mike Vernon. Premier Black Gold. Black Gold. You know, some really nice cards from the 90s here. Oh, look at that. That's awesome. Premier Black Gold and Mats. That's awesome right there. Sundin. That's cool. Um, Uncle Todd Super Rookie. Super Skills. Look at that. Uncle Todd. What the heck is that weird design by his jersey there? Look at that. <laughs> nice. Got some Topps Finest. Geeky Bear. There you go. Protective coating on that. Geeky Bear. Got another one, Dan Cluche, Team Canada there. More Tops Finest, Trevor Kidd. Oh my gosh, look at this card here. Got an Uncle Todd, what parallel is that? That's 0304, I should open a box of that. I can open a box of that. That's uh, 0304 Tops. Uncle Todd, 40 of 50, that's pretty low numbered. For something back then, that's pretty low numbered. And yeah, there you go, that's cool. Oh, we got a Patrick Waugh, Tops Chrome, that looks really nice. What year is that? Not sure what year that is. Oh, two, oh, three tops chrome? Huh. Like a reprint. Obviously, it's uh, supposed to go off of, I think, 87, 88 tops there. Uncle Todd, I definitely remember these. I opened this stuff. Um, I know my brother had a ton of these. Oh, three, oh, four. There you go. He was third behind Aginla and his teammate, line mate, Marcus Naslund. Huh. There's Heater. Rookie points. There you go. Number one. Look at that. 67. Nobody close. Uh, another points on the game, Uncle Todd. He had 97, right? Yeah, look at that. Top five in points. He was so awesome. There you go. Naslin, number two there, 104. Forsberg, 106. Heater, 89 points, number nine. There's Naslin. He was up there as well. Number two, 104 points. Ooh, Dan Cluche. Tops Chrome. This is like a black border. Is that numbered? It has to be numbered, right? Yep. 56 of 100. That's nice right there. That's 0203 tops. And another Dan Clucci, that's the year after or the year before. Year before, a 102. That one's number to 50. So very cool. <laughs> Alright, we're coming down to it. We got these and then the one touches. Oh, look at that. Tops Heritage. Heater. Calder Trophy winner. These are beautiful. Look at that. Tops Heritage. Heater. I'm definitely gonna have to get some tops, don't I? Even though I think James had a couple of boxes, I'm guessing they're gonna be tops. But yeah, look at that. The original six. Authentic arena seat of Marc Messier. Is that a Madison Square Garden seat? That's really interesting if it is. Looks like it is. That's kind of funny. Madison Square Garden seat. Okay then. Oh wow, look at this. Authentic. Oh my gosh. Uncle Todd. Authentic auto. Tops Heritage. Look at that auto on card. That's so awesome. Uncle Todd. <laughs> Look at that. That's awesome. Oh, and the next card. Tops C55. I've seen this stuff. It's like, what the heck is this? But look at that. Look how tiny <laughs> JSG Gear's little auto is there. Actual auto. Awesome. But yeah, these Tops C55. They're kind of weird. I'm pretty sure they're probably based on vintage stuff. I'm pretty sure it's based off of. But look at that. Shiger. Auto, top C55. Is that 0304, I would assume, or 0203? 0304, C55. Huh. Uh, of course, Uncle Todd. You got the C55 auto of him as well. That's awesome right there. Look at that. Tops pledges to bring you closer to the game and its leading players. The signing of all Tops autograph cards is witnessed by Tops representatives to guarantee authenticity. Huh. Oh my gosh, this next card. <laughs> Uh, we got an authentic game worn suit, Don Cherry. Oh my gosh, game worn. Did he wear that in the seventies as a coach of the Bruins? That is so awesome. If that's the case, one of hockey's most colorful, outspoken characters, Grapes played in the minors with great gusto and later coached in the NHL with equal spirit. In his high, sartorial fashion, Don ran the bench in Boston, 74-79, and Colorado, 79-80, and in 76, won the Jack Adams Awards. There's a picture of him there. I gotta touch that. Let's touch that. Alright, now I gotta smell it. Oh my gosh, that, oh, that smells weird. What the heck? 
Smells like a jacket from the 70s. Jeez. Okay, well, <laughs> that's awesome. Game Gear Don Cherry. But there you go. I don't know why he would let somebody cut up one of his suits, but there you go. Next up, oh, look at that. Another Topps Auto of Jay Shiger. Look at that tiny little spot for Shiger there. But that's from, uh, what the heck is that from? Topps Pristine. That's a really nice looking card there, Jay Shiger. And we got two more cards here. Look at this. Pristine Profiles, also from Topps Pristine. Dan Cluche. There you go. Another uh, game worn jersey relic card. Nice. It's making me want to open some tops. Look at this Uncle Todd pristine patches. Look at that. That's so awesome. Tops pristine. <laughs> All right, we got a few more cards and we'll reveal the boxes James sent. Oh, another card here. Oh, look at that. That's definitely a rookie. Marc Andre Fleury, rare rookie. Look at that. Tops pristine. Only the 199. Really cool. Good luck finding 0304 Series 1 for a reasonable price. His Young Guns is freaking bonkers, I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, it's like hundreds of dollars for his Young Guns now. His future Watch is up there as well. But yeah, there we go, Mark Andre Fleury, future Hall of Famer. Uh, rookie, rare rookie, awesome. Okay, next up, what the heck is this case? It's so weird. It's like a weird one touch, but we got encased a heater from Topps Pristine. Look at that. That's numbered only to 59. Oh, three or four tops pristine. That's really cool there. Another pristine, another sealed one. Uncle Todd, pristine portions, authentic game worn jersey. Look at that. Only the 25. Wow, two of 25 for Uncle Todd there. Some really awesome Uncle Todd heater stuff this mail from James. And the last card. We got a pristine portions. Another authentic game worn jersey. Heater. Look at that. 5 of 25. Wow, I'm not too familiar with Topps Pristine. I definitely should look it up now, but... Huh. Wow. And there's a couple of boxes here. Okay, first box. Wow. We got some Topps. 0102 Topps Chrome. Awesome. I was actually going to get a box of this. Now I don't have to. So yeah, I expect a video of that pretty soon because, well, past the SBA Master, I'm not sure what I'm opening. So expect this very soon. This will buy me some time. And then it'll be a fun break. And James sent one more box. Awesome. Look at this. Been meaning to open this one too. We got, is that 0203 Stadium Club? I think it is. I opened 99-2001. I think this is uh, 0203. I think so. Yeah. It's either 0102 or 0203. Stadium Club. Pretty sure it's 0203. But there you go. Relic auto insertion rate 112. That's much higher than... Like 001 and 99-2000. But yeah, look at that. A Relic Tribute to Patrick Wall. Ah, it's going to be a fun break. And you can see the Lone Star signatures here. Who we got in here? Uh, healthy. Oh, Uncle Todd's in here. Oh, a lot of interesting names in there. Okay. That's going to be a fun break. So, James. Once again, absolutely amazing. Amazing. And if you guys are wondering, I am hunting Elias and Quinn Hughes stuff on his behalf, and it's not been going too well. So I'm definitely going to get some 1819 stuff because I want to hunt Elias for James. I want to hunt Hart for myself, so I think it would make sense to get some 1819. At least some more of it. Not sure what products, though. You guys should let me know what products you want to see me open. You want me to get more SBA of, like, 1819? Even though I actually completed the set, I just need the updates now, but... Yeah, James, thank you so much once again. You're the best. Yeah. So, yeah, guys, another mail will be coming very shortly. I got a bunch of other stuff to go through. I decided to open this one first because James told me there's boxes in here, and he told me not to uh, order any boxes before opening his package so there you go so yeah guys stay tuned for more bricks to come including top stadium club and top chrome and as always thanks for watching and i'll see you guys later